Set for a start, heat number one, in for the start, and standing on it as they go up into the top corner. Alan Barley trying to get the break, and McDonald looks down the inside of him, and Shaw gets through smartly as well. They go to the bottom corner, McDonald putting plenty of pressure on Barley here. Tries to get down the inside, can't do it. Actually, Lacey's the big mover in the pack as he goes through there on the inside. Murphy tries to go to the outside, but it's one lane. Here comes McDonald, though. He uses a part of the infield, gets the lead, and Barley fights him back on the inside. Race leader being challenged as he goes back into turn number one, and it's McDonald, the 32 car in the back straightaway. Barley and car number 10 running second. The double six car from New South Wales for Keldix is John Shaw. Then further back, we've got car two, Wayne Bunker from South Australia. Race leader now opening up by the length of six or seven cars as they go around the top turn. Past the start finish line to record another lap. As we see car 55, Grant Tucks unfortunately on the infield. Yes, his race has not lasted long. He might have been 12 cubic inches short, but he's one heat short now. They come across the strike. Race leader McDonald of Queensland, Shaw of Sydney. Then it's Alan Barley on the Triple M car, followed by Robbie Farr. They go up into turn number one, but I tell you what, no one is going to run down the race leader. Here he is now, comes down the front straight, tail hard into the turn, stands on the gas as he picks it up, and look at the gap he's establishing over Alan Barley. Great dice developing back for fifth and sixth, but the race leader's got it shot to pieces at the moment. Car 32 from Queensland, all the way from Bundaberg is Nathan McDonald down the back shoot into turn three. As we see the white flag being prepared, he comes on past two to go this time around. And he's opened up that length again from John Shaw in the double six car. Further back from that, we've got car 10 from Victoria, Alan Barley, but nobody's going to challenge this man on the track. Perfect line into turn one, cuts it down low. He comes up behind car two for Victoria Milburn as the checkered flag is being prepared and the race goes to car number 32. Nathan McDonald from Queensland. John Shaw follows him across in second place in car 66. They're followed by Alan Barley in third and in fourth place. The flying lad from Sydney in car three in Robert Farr. Well, a good drive and a good opening run for Nathan McDonald of Queensland. Car number 32. Put your hands together. Great drive that. That's the way you like to get started in the national. And that's to win your opening heat on the program. And Nathan McDonald of Queensland has done just that. John Shaw of the Central Coast in New South Wales and the Texaco Haviland car, the Caltex car, finished in second spot. And Alan Barley and uh, Robert Farr had a dice there for a long time in that uh, event. Barley dropping a spot in the closing stages of the race.